What do men most often get wrong about women? Two things. That we only care about money or that our goal in life is to end up with a man. What's your goal in life? To be happy. Happiness is a solid goal. Well, sometimes you have to provide it for yourself and you should never look for happiness in someone else. People come and go. People die. It happens. Well, why do you think people can't be happy alone? I think that people are capable of being happy alone. I just think that over time, you start to be like, fuck, I wish I had somebody to share this with. I, I mean, like, personally, that's my thing. I'm okay with being alone. Fuck it, I've been alone long enough. But having someone else to share your happiness with or to make other happy memories with, it just kind of makes it a little bit more meaningful. It's, it's nice to have shared experiences with other people, but you also have to be okay with being by yourself and know how you're happy by yourself in order to make those relationships like really really count no i completely agree honestly it's kind of like masturbating you know we can all enjoy masturbating you know you get your fill out of it you're feeling good you're on a high however it's a little bit different when you have somebody else to enjoy the moment with you right it hits a little different it's true it hits different <laughs> what do you struggle the most with when dating i've become so acclimated to being alone that now i'm almost irked by another person's presence mm -hmm. like I like my things clean and tidy and yet when I'm with someone I want to make sure that I'm being a good host I'm giving them my attention I'm being attentive and affectionate so then I kind of like let other things fall away like mm -hmm. oh I'll do the laundry but I may not fold it for a couple days because I'm going to sit on the couch with you or I'm going to help you with whatever I'm going to ask you to like help me film stuff while I'm working or whatever so I feel like I personally oh man I feel like I have nothing left to give anybody anymore which I guess is really like sad but I mean like I feel like I've given so much of myself to the wrong people mm -hmm. that I don't have as much patience as I used to. I don't have as much love to give. And I'm just that's sad. Like, I'm kind of, like, empty in a sense. So, like, I'm probably the last person on earth to ask dating advice from right now. <laughs> Fuck. I just realized that. That sucks. <laughs> but you also have all this experience from other relationships, whether they worked or didn't. They still, you know, play a meaning meaningful role in, like, you know, with shaping you in a per as a person in some way. And then also you're learning things like what makes you a good partner, what you don't like in another partner and things like that. So it's like, you know, the way you feel right now isn't going to necessarily be the way you're going to feel later on, whether you find someone not. or not. I hope I don't feel that way. Yeah, I hope not too. But hey, just for the record, don't do what I've done. Don't do it. Yeah, don't do it. 